this is a bow that I did in Brindleton Bay. So this is in kind of like the foriest area of Brindleton, Brindleton Bay. Oh my god, I can't talk. So yeah, um, I need a family for this house. That's why I built it here. Because I've been realizing that a lot of the times when I want to make bows in The Sims 4 for my safe, I want to make families with them. I... <coughs> <coughs> I hope that's understandable, but yeah, I know some builders are just kind of like, okay, I'm just going to make this house, and I don't want to make a no CC family or something like that, but I like making no CC families, honestly, I just, it's just fun for me, sorry, I'm in my basement, um, yeah, and, uh, I'm not in, like, a weird basement, like, in, like, a uh, furnished basement, and there's a TV here and stuff like that. And, um, yeah, so my boy, I feel really bad because my boyfriend left the room just to let me do his voiceover. He's a very good guy, but, yeah, um, sometimes I have OCD when it comes to my voiceovers. I'm like, oh my god, I have to just do this voiceover and, like, get it over with and, like, you know, delete the original videos and then export the video to YouTube and stuff like that, if you know what I mean. But yeah, I get like all caught up on that and like I'm just obsessed. My YouTube channel is just an obsession. But I enjoy it though. I do. But yeah, anyway, I'm still sick, so sorry about the coughing in this video. I can't really help it. I I do have an inhaler that I'm using now as of the date that I'm recording this voiceover. And um the inhaler is working. It just it's I've only used it for like one day, so it's not working like like, perfectly, I guess, it really isn't, so, um, yeah, um, that's too bad, oh, sorry, I'm, just, I'm opening up the, the screen of the recording of my, me building this house a bit more, so I can see what I'm doing better, because I realize I have it so tiny sometimes, and I'm like, what am I doing, because it's, like, so small, and I have bad eyes, <laughs> my eyes are really bad, even though I have glasses, my eyesight is very bad, but anyway, yeah, so, um, by this time this video goes out, I probably have Planet Zoo videos out, or I hope I do, or at least have started making some. But yeah, I really enjoy that game, um, when I play the beta access version, and I can't wait to play it again. Um, yeah, so, <laughs> I really enjoyed it, it's a very, uh, you know, and fun game. It, I think even people who, like, weren't into that stuff can, in, or people who aren't really into games like that can even enjoy it. At least that's my opinion. Because, like, trust me, like, I've played The Sims for, like, for five years. I know it doesn't sound like that long. Probably six years. I don't know. But, um, and I'm 20, but yeah, so... Um, and then I started playing Zoo Tycoon, and I really liked Zoo Tycoon. I originally played Zoo Tycoon when I was a kid, but then I just thought, like, whatever, I'll just, you know, download the game again and play it again, because I was inspired to this other YouTuber. She, yeah, um, I don't know if she posts anymore, which is kind of sad, but I really like her videos. I, like, liked her videos, but, yeah, she would post Zoo Tycoon videos, and, um... And I was really inspired to post Zoo Tycoon 1 videos. And I know, we're already on to the interior. That went so quickly. Sorry that it went so quickly. I just... I wanted to cut some things out. So, yeah. I didn't want this video to be too long, too long to keep my boyfriend waiting too long. But, yeah, basically what I'm saying is, like, I started playing Zoo Tycoon 1, and I played Zoo Tycoon... Then I played... No, I started playing Zoo Tycoon 2, and then I started playing Zoo Tycoon 1 since like, months ago, like, almost a year ago, I think, I'm not sure if it's actually been a year, honestly, I've done a lot with my channel in a year, so it's kind of hard to tell if it's been a year, because I make videos, like, every single day, and sometimes upload twice, a, or three times a day, or four times a day, even, so sorry if you don't like that, um, just say, if you don't like the Zoo Tycoon one videos, then you can just ignore them, honestly, um, yeah, it's, I don't need all the recognition recognition for that because this is mainly a sims channel but yeah um, if you do like my zoo tycoon one videos then that's great I, I really appreciate it but 
Yeah, because I enjoy that game, and I'm looking forward to playing Planet Zoo. So yeah, um, this is the kitchen. <laughs> the kitchen took me a while, and I know it looks massive, but the counters, like, you know, I think you can have a massive kitchen in The Sims 4, you should just add a bunch of counters, and then you're good. <laughs> like, counters everywhere, like, I mean, I know that sounds like, like, a typical thing, like, oh, who would have thought of that? Like, every, anyone would think of that, like, but I don't, it just helps to fill up a room, at least for me, because I try to build as fast as possible. I know it sounds kind of bad, like, oh, I try to get the build done as fast as I can, but it's, it's just because I, I get anxious when I'm building, and I get, like, I enjoy it, but sometimes I'm just like, oh, I need, like, a break, and then, like, and I don't want to make it into, like, three separate long videos, so I'm like, you know, I'm just gonna wing it and do this whole build in one sitting, so, yeah, but, yeah, but I hope you still, you guys still like my builds, um, I mean, I've been getting a lot of support with my builds, which I'm very happy about, but, yeah, so, um, oh yeah, I realized I forgot to add in any pets things in this house. You'll see the family at the end of the house, at the end of the, at the end of the speed build, they're, a, they're in a family, it's just this girl, she lives with her three cats and one dog, and the dog, <laughs> one thing I regret about this family is that the dog is, like, the dog, I'm, the dog is, like, a mixed breed, but I'm not good at making pets in The Sims 4. I know I'm good at, like, creating Sims in The Sims 4, but I'm not good at all. At, I'm not good at all at making pets in The Sims 4, so, yeah, that's, um, that's unfortunate, <laughs> but I, there's nothing I can really do about it. I feel like it's not common for Sims YouTubers or whatever, or Sims, at least Sims, at least the Sims YouTuber I've seen to be so, like, com good at, like, making pets, and I think it's very difficult, at least for me it is, I mean, I know you can just choose a breed and be like, okay, that, I'm just gonna stick with that, or, like, choose a mixed breed, but for me, even choosing mixed breeds is, like, hard, because I'm, like, I want this dog to look realistic, like, I don't want the dog to look like it's, like, some alien or something, I'm sorry, that's mean, um, I think the cat mixed breeds in The Sims 4, when you, when you mix breed a cat in The Sims 4, I think they look great, but, um, a dog is just kind of, like, eh, like, I don't know, the dog is just kind of, like, weird looking, just, like, weird, in my opinion, I don't know that, I hope I'm not offending anyone, but, yeah, I'm not really a dog person anyway, I'm really not, I've been, like, a cat person my whole life, I think even when I was a kid, I was like, okay, I'm gonna have cats when I get older, and I think at one point I was like, oh, I want to have a dog, and we were moving to a new house, and I was like, I want to get a dog, this is when I was like 10 years old, or 9, I don't even know, or I might have been even 8 or 9 years old, and I was like, I want to get a dog, I want to get a dog, I can't wait, I want to get a dog for my new house, I mean, for our new house, obviously, if I was 9 years old, I wouldn't be getting my own house, <laughs> but, but I wanted a dog, and my mom just, my mom likes dogs, but we just didn't get a dog, but then a couple years later, we got cats, and then I fell in love <laughs> with cats. I also fell in love with my boyfriend, but sorry, I sound so pathetic right now. <laughs> but anyway, um, yeah, I think we're just working on the office area now. So these two rooms up here are, like, both for, like, the pets. And there is, <laughs> there is a bedroom in this room, but it's kind of, like, it's a guest bedroom. As you can see, there's, like, things of clothes where you can... I don't know, I don't even know how to describe it, but, um, it's like a, a guest bedroom, not a kid's bedroom, because she, there's a lady who lives in this house, she doesn't have kids, she doesn't want kids, she doesn't want a boyfriend, anything like that, she just wants to have pets, and she's on flirty also, but she is very pretty, um, but yeah, she, yeah, I'm creating her now, I didn't, inc I didn't include me making the last bathroom, She's so pretty. I just, I'm so proud of the way she turned out. I think she's so gorgeous. And I really like her nose and her lips. I don't know, I just was really happy with the way she, her nose and lips turned out. I know it's kind of weird to say, but I just think she has, like, beautiful features. I don't know where she would be from, but I didn't really think about that. But I was just trying to make her look different from my other sims. At the same time, making her looking pretty and stuff like that, but... Yeah, um, yeah, so I don't really know what else to say. 
Um, <laughs> this is a Sims video. Um, <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Oh, I don't know why I dressed her in these panties. That's kind of awkward. Sorry I did that. I just was scrolling through the, the clothes and now I'm embarrassing myself. <laughs> I don't know, I would just, I just do that, like, sometimes I'll create sims, and I'll scroll through the catalog, and just see, oh, how would they look in this, and, like, just randomly, <laughs> it's weird, but anyway, um, I forget what I was, where I was going with this before, what I was saying before, um, but yeah, she has, but yeah, the room, the bedroom, the second bedroom is, like, basically for the pets, mostly for the pets, but it can also be a guest bedroom, I could have said that so much of an easier way, but I didn't, anyway, <laughs> Yeah, this is, um, I think this is, she has three cats. She's definitely a cat person, but she's all, she, all, I also gave her the dog lover trait. So she has, um, a, a mixed dog, <laughs> a mixed breed dog. I don't know, like, what kind of dog it is, like, like a, I forget what kind of dog it was, or what mixed it was, I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> But yeah, this is the last cat. I, I named this cat China. Well, that's not a cat, but I, 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 the mix, it doesn't, it's not a raccoon. It's a cat. When it, it turns out to be a cat, but not a raccoon. That's kind of weird, but, um, the cat, I named her China and I just thought that was so adorable because, you know, like China's cute name for a dog and, and it could be a cute name for a cat. But yeah, here I am just trying out different braids and I'm like, uh, this looks weird. <laughs> just look weird. I mean, that's just, it's probably just me, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, and I stuck with this dog, and I was like, after I made the family, I was like, why? Why did I stick with that dog? That dog is kind of weird, not realistic looking. I mean, I'm not trying to offend anyone who's had a, who has a dog who looks like this, but I just don't think the dog looks, anyway, these are screenshots, I'm going to just spell Thanks for watching. Bye!